Hi guys, welcome back to another episode of Pip My Thomas. Today I'm back here with a very special custom and of course, as always, as you may have seen from both the title and the thumbnail, today I'm gonna talk about this guy here, my custom take and play marketing engine. So for those who may be not who may not be really familiar with the model series, uh, this engine here without a face like this was a background model uh, used in the first season um, but I'm probably going to leave a more detailed description down here in the um, in the pinned comment down here in the comment section or even possibly a link to the um, Thomas wiki I don't know I have I still have to decide anyway um, it was made out of um, Take and play Rosie, as you may have guessed, with a new uh, stupid uh, redesign magnet like this. And I've added a lot of cardboard here on the side tanks and even on the cab on the rear. And you know, basically a mix of cardboard and paper to make it different, of course, uh, from Rosie's uh, looks, you know, because I didn't really want to, you know to have just a simple um, rosy but painted black, you know, just like some people tend to do. But I also wanted to uh, make the side tanks bigger and get this slanted effect on the, um, on the cab here, like in the real engine, like this, okay? And to make this, what I did was that I added um, three layers of cardboard, you can see one, two and three, plus another layer of uh, more um, of thinner paper like this, but I added uh, three layers of cardboard on each side so that the tanks would extend up to this point here of the foot plate. And I also left a bit of space here on each side so that the cardboard wouldn't interfere with those steps here because otherwise I would have um, needed to sand them down like this but I wanted to keep them so I decided to you know uh, make sure uh, these steps here sorry everything just moved anyway uh, I wanted to make sure this part here would fit on these um, ladders here and now I'm going to uh, put everything together back again like this because you saw uh, how everything works and I also added of course window detailing like this even on on the side and the face is just um, you know Rosie's face like the face belongs to this original model but without the freckles and I gotta say it looks kind of pretty neutral as a face like it can be masculine, feminine, I don't know, you can you can decide. For me, uh, the marketing engine uh, is a boy in my books. Anyways, you can also see um, black top here and red bottom here. And that is because uh, the German engines always have this red uh, bottom chassis here, even if it's not visible, but it's red. Anyways. I hope you liked this custom and as always let me know what you think down in down here in the comments and I'll see you next time. Bye guys.